Today we're going to try our hands at a banana moon pie. Now for you that don't know what a moon pie is, it's like a marshmallow cakey kind of thing. A graham crackery cake top and bottom cookie type thing. The banana ones have like a yellow creamy stuff that covers the whole thing, the top to bottom, the filling and everything. We are going to try our best to make a banana moon pie juice. On what scale? Still making 10 mils because it's still experimental. Don't want to make a whole bunch and not like it. So we're sticking with 10 mils for now. We are using majority of, well, just about everything is flavor of the apprentice. We have our banana that I'm using. It's from Flavor Art. Since I got the banana in my hand, I might as well start with it. We're going to use 1% of the banana. Next is the banana cream. Get the DX banana cream. 5%. Got 2% of graham cracker crust. I'm using the cheesecake graham cracker crust. 0.5 of the hazelnut. My understanding is the hazelnut is one of those flavor enhancers that brings everything together. You got one percent marshmallow. Four percent vanilla custard. We'll top it all off with 2% of some fresh cream. Top it all off with my 75-25-2 milligram blend that's all pre-made. So all I have to do is top off my bottle. Now as usual, we know this isn't going to taste right. Especially something with uh, seven flavors, so it's a little bit complex. So I'm sure it's not going to taste right, but got to try it anyway, right? Not bad. It's nice and creamy. Not too much banana, just enough so far. 
can't taste the graham cracker yet. So we'll let this steep a week or two and give it another try. Hopefully everything will blend together and we'll see how it does. Not too bad. So thanks for coming along on this DIY journey as I learn how to make my own juice. We're going to keep on giving this a try. So far it's going pretty good. I'm learning, so come along, learn with me. If you got any tips or tricks, go ahead and leave some comments below. This is Blind Views. Thanks for watching, and that's the way I see it. What we do here is go back, 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 back.